Hello, my name is Ms. Kaja and I am the KB homeroom teacher at Fuentes. This is my second year teaching kindergarten at Fuentes. A typical day in kindergarten starts at 7.45 a.m. when the students arrive and they will have breakfast in the classroom. After we finish breakfast, we start our morning meeting where we will do the calendar, we'll do the days of the week, the months of the year, we'll talk about the weather, we'll talk about how we're feeling, we'll go over the classroom rules, and then we'll read a story. Then we transition into all of our learning activities throughout the day. Uh, the students will have a lot of time to work on literacy and math skills in our classroom. And this can look like a variety of ways where students will do whole group sessions with the teacher. Uh, they will have time to do small group activities as well. And they will have time to use technology resources that we incorporate into our curriculum. Each student will have a Chromebook and they typically spend about one hour per day on literacy and math curriculum on their Chromebooks. Students will also have about 30 minutes of science or social studies every day. They will also have a 30 minute lunch break and a 30 minute recess break. Every day, the students have a different specials class and that can include gym, art, Spanish, and music. Um, and then they will also have time every day to work with the academic inter interventionist um, and the bilingual specialist who come in to help with literacy and math skills. Uh, at the end of the day, we pack up all of our belongings and we have our closing meeting. And that's where we'll talk about what our favorite parts of the day were and any special announcements for the next day. Um, and then dismissal happens at about 3.30 p.m. Thank you for taking the time to learn about kindergarten at Fuentes and we hope to meet you all next year. Take care, bye. Hi everyone, my name is Ms. Hansen and I am the visual art teacher at Fuentes. Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Barron. I am the music teacher at Fuentes. Hi, I'm Ms. Cordova and I am the PE teacher at Fuentes. Hola, hola. My name is Ms. Covarrubias and I am the Spanish teacher at Fuentes. We AMPS teachers wanted to introduce ourselves to you and tell us, tell you a little bit about our classes. AMPS stands for Art, Music, PE, and Spanish classes that students take every week. These classes provide engaging opportunities for your student to explore their talents and interests and to develop skills that will support and improve their success in other subjects. In art class, students practice and develop important habits such as making observations, developing craftsmanship, engaging and persisting in the creative process, exploring their ideas, and learning to express themselves visually. Students learn to reflect on their work and utilize artistic expression as a way to understand more about themselves and their experiences, as well as the experiences of others. The skills developed in the art room connect to and support the learning students do in all their other subject areas and strengthen their engagement throughout the school day. And here at Fuentes, we have music class every week where we learn how it plays such an important role in our society. Our music education goals are to learn dozens of songs, both singing and playing instruments from many cultures around the world. The instruments that we have available are ukulele, lots of percussion instruments, guitars, and pianos. For the middle school students, we also learn how to record music and create electronic beats. So while we're always challenging ourselves, we are always having fun. Most of all, the music classroom is a place where students learn the importance of community and teamwork, working together to create something bigger than themselves. In physical education, students explore and develop the fundamentals, the fundamental skills necessary to participate in a variety of physical activities, including sports, adventure activities, dance, and fitness. 
Engaging in a wide range of physical activities allows students to see the value in all physical movement and increases their ability to remain physically active for life. While developing their motor skills, students also build social skills such as sportsmanship, accountability, communication, collaboration, and problem solving. With Spanish being one of the most spoken languages in the world, it is important for students to learn about this beautiful language. In Spanish class, students not only learn about Spanish grammar and key vocabulary, but they also practice and develop important language skills. Students will strengthen their listening, speaking, reading, and writing skills that ultimately help students not only be able to express themselves, but be able to communicate with others. In addition to these important linguistic skills, students <laughs> learn about Spanish speaking countries and their cultures. Learning about these countries enhances their knowledge about the world and allows students to make significant connections to their own backgrounds. Overall, students will be able to use their learning in Spanish class beyond the classroom to effectively interact with their communities and the world around them. We hope that learning more about our classes has made you excited for your student to become a part of our Cuentas family. We are certainly very excited to meet them and we hope that we get the opportunity to get to know them in our classrooms very soon. Go, Go Eagles! Eagles! Hello everyone, I'm Ms. Navarro. I'm in the fifth grade and I've been here since kindergarten. What I really like about the school, it has really nice teachers, has great education, and has really kind people. So, also, I also think that the school, like, it has taught me so much. It has taught me great things. It has very fun activities. And, yeah. Hi, I think Fuentes is a great school to go to because it is a lively, sophisticated community. There are many things to like about Fuentes, but what I especially like about it is that there are always going to be these supportive teachers to push you, and you will have these amazing friends to be there for you. Thank you for listening. Have an amazing day.